she just imagined that, that Candyman was there and um, killed him. I don't know. Just my take on how that could be explained without him having physical powers. Of course, maybe he does have physical powers at that point. That's also a possibility. But yeah, in case anyone is unsure why I, I maybe at, at the very um, I I maybe wasn't sure at first why exactly the people lit the the pile on fire and why Candyman seemed to want to stay there. My theory on why he stayed there is definitely the kid. It was. I don't know if the um, if the people lighting it on fire. I guess they didn't realize that the kid was there, and he wanted it to be that you know afterward they'd all realize, oh my God, we burned an infant, you know, and that would again reinforce uh, the belief, and then uh, Helen would be dead, and I think she was always going to become a myth and a legend. It's just the fact that she saved the kid made him cease to be a myth and a legend because, you know, you can't beat a legend, you can't uh, kill a myth. As for why they set it on fire, I would guess that they believed that he was up there or, you know, I don't know, some, some kind of idea they had that he was going to be up there, that it would kill him if they lit it on fire. I don't know, maybe it was um, just to get to Helen, because she was climbing up, um, you know, that was, uh, I think that was specifically what they saw, and then they went out. So, maybe, um, I don't know exactly. I think that's it for this one. See you next time.